Hi there, and welcome to the Ad Maker. This is Brian, your host. I would just like to say that last week I was 7 and 8. Okay, that's not that good. But I should have been 15 and 0 if I had got a few bounces to go my way. So trust me, this week, 15 and 0, block. If not, I will send you a check. Just send me an email to happydude53406 at gmail.com and I'll send you a check. Okay, first game. Bears plus three at Panthers. Bears plus three at Panthers. You gotta be kidding me. I took the Bears last week. I'm taking the Bears again this week. Saints minus two at Redskins. Saints minus two at Redskins. Saints, Saints, Saints. Take the Saints. Give the points. Bills plus 5.5 at Jaguars. Bills five and a half over to Jaguars. Jaguars don't have an offensive line right now. You gotta go with the Bills. Giants minus six at Rams. The Giants are gonna kick the living crap out of the Rams. This line could be Giants favored by 28 and they'd still cover. Take that Giants. Titans plus three at Bengals. The Titans plus three at Bengals. Carson Palmer's gonna bounce back. This is my upset special. Grab the bungles with the points. Packers minus three at Lions. The Lions are absolutely probably the second worst team in football. If you don't take the Packers and the points, you're just retarded. <laughs> Ravens plus five at Texans. The Ravens plus five at Texans. This game has been moved to Monday night because of Hurricane Katrina or whatever the hell it's called. <laughs> so we're going to say Ravens, but I don't like either one. <coughs> Steelers minus four at Browns. Steelers, take them, give the points. Raiders plus three at Chiefs. Raiders, shouldn't, Raiders are getting three points. Raiders should get at least a dozen every time they step on the field. The Raiders are absolutely the third worst team in football behind the Rams and the Lions. If you even put money on the Raiders, you're a moron. Colts minus two at Vikings. Colts are going to kick the living crap out of the Vikings. If the Packers with their offense and Aaron Rodgers could pick them apart, imagine what a Peyton Manning could do. Take Manning, the points, and the dome. 49ers plus 9.5 at Seahawks. This game is really worrying me. It should be a pick em. Why? Because no matter who you pick, you're a loser for picking this game. But since I'm here to give you the facts, take the 49ers in the 9.5. Falcons plus 8 at TB Bucks. That would be Tampa Bay. What was the point spread again? Plus 8. Falcons. Falcons plus 8 against Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay is going with Brian Greasy. I like Greasy because he's from Michigan. <laughs> Go with Greasy in the points. Dolphins plus eight at AZ Cardinals. The Cardinals take the eight. Okay. Patriots plus three at New York Jets. Even without them, this line could be absolutely huge. The Patriots are going to show they don't need touchdown Tommy. Brett the Jet looked good week one. They're done. Jets, your losing streak starts now. Chargers minus 2.5 at Broncos. This is going to be a tough game. I'm not sure who's going to win. But one thing I do know is if you listen to me, you're going to win money. Take the Broncos. Eagles plus 7.5 at Cowboys. Cowboys are going to liberate the Philadelphia Eagles on Monday night football. Jerry Jones will not allow his guys to lose the spread. So I say take Dallas. Give 95 points. That's how confident I am. They're going to blow them out. This has been the odds maker.